Semites, Yosemites, towering sequoias. Just like cedars and what have you. The coastal redwood, and you all see the picture here. The giant sequoia is the largest tree. The coastal redwood is the tallest tree. Slow stroll, stroll through the uh, lower grove here. Beautiful branches on that one there. Look at the size Cinematic. of the branches on that one. It's huge. Um, the fire policies, one of the gentlemen was blunt. We'll work on the fish and all the way through to you. What, what, what we might see and might not Michael see. Michael Bay. But anyway. <laughs> go ahead and hug it, babe. Huh? Go ahead and hug it. There you go. Just to be fun. Learning all about the trees here in Yosemite with our guide Grant, my man. Check him out. This is just a warm-up for Glacier Point. You wow. see the curved domes there. Those are well, those are granite formations that the ice has come over millennia ago. See a waterfall right here. They were they never allow that today, but they were a little different back then, and you don't tell Teddy what not to do, he'd punch you out. So yeah, Teddy's out there and got a great picture on that rock there. And like I said, guys, this is described as one of the most photographed vistas on Earth. You've seen all the pictures from here. Don't recognize it, and now you're going to get your pictures from here. You in. Folks, this is called Tunnel View. Okay, my shirt. I'm wearing right now for that t-shirt. What would I say? Some old lady. I can't go El Capitan right there. El Capitan. Try not to bump the scope, but get in line and look. And they've got them focused right on the people up there. And they'll answer questions too. These people are experienced climbers. They've forgotten more than I'll know. It's a mile long by 3,600 feet above us or three Empire State buildings stacked up. Very top, those are trees. Some of them wind blown, a lot of them, a lot of the leaves or needles blow off, and those are trees. And we have the...